Hi there and welcome to the very first video on a brand new second YouTube channel. Um, I'm Aaron Chana, hi. Uh, and this is all about the latest uh, in football and latest news transfers. So for those of you who are on SoundCloud and MixCloud, you'll know we had a podcast called Millennium Football. That is being moved over here. Uh, onto the YouTube platform and we're going to be talking about the latest news, latest transfers, everything that's going off in the world of football. Uh, so I hope you guys are ready for that, I hope you guys really love this secondary channel. Uh, if you do like it, give it a like if you love it, give it a subscribe and let's get into this, our very first uh, video. This is part of the Transfer uh, Centre playlist, the, the playlist of videos called Transfer Centre, where we talk about the latest rumours, speculation surrounding transfers we're going to be diving really deep into this so let's get kick-started with Thomas Mounier now if you don't know who this guy is he's a Belgian fullback a right back at Paris Saint-Germain in Ligue 1 in France and the sources have told ESPN via an article about ESPN that Thomas Mounier is set to join Borussia Dortmund in the summer now, Mounier is out of contract at Paris Saint-Germain uh, in June. Now, of course, that isn't the only player to be out of contract at Paris Saint-Germain in June. Uh, other players out of contract um, is Lavin Kazawa, who almost joined Juventus in January, and apparently the Italian giants are a likely destination for Kazawa. Uh, Edison Cavani became the club's all-time record goal scorer this season, but his best years are apparently behind him. And Thiago Silva, who's been at the club since 2012, he too won't be offered an extension. So that's Kazawa, Cavani, Silva uh, and Mounier out of contract with Kazawa rumoured to be joining Juventus. No decision on the future yet of Cavani or uh, Silva. But we do have rumours of, of these reports, sources have told ESPN that Mounier is set to join Borussia Dortmund. Now, Borussia Dortmund already has two Belgian international players in Axel Witzel, the midfielder, and the attacking player Thorgan Hazard, uh, his brother Eden, of course, at Real Madrid in La Liga. Now, Mounier actually would be a good addition uh, to Dortmund's back line. It's already very, very strong. Now, of course, one of the main reasons for this transfer to happen is of course the fact that uh, Akraf Hakimi, uh, their right back who's been on loan at Dortmund for the last couple of years, he is set to go back to, the, to Real Madrid at the end of his loan spell. So, using the website oneversusone.com, I decided to compare statistics between Hakimi and Mounier. So comparing the two players in terms of statistics, let's have a look at how they compare. So, how they compare is the fact that um, in terms of total blocks, Mounier has made five, where Hakimi has made one this season. Total tackles, 39 to 77 in favour of Hakimi. Aerial duels, 19 to 20 in favour of Hakimi. Uh, Mounier, in terms of assists, has two assists, seven key passes and a total of nine chances. And Hakimi has ten assists and eight key passes and a total chances of 18 with a pass completion rate of 85.2% to 84.72% in favour of Mounier. So, Mounier has a better pass completion rate than Hakimi. However, he's put in more assists, he's put in um, more aerial duels. He's done better in most of the categories than Mounier, so it would be a little bit of a step down from Hakimi. However, uh, I think that Mounier would be still a good replacement because he fills that pass completion rate. So everything that he sort of lacks compared to Hakimi, he can improve on uh, in Dortmund's back line. I know the coach can really help him if he does decide to go to Dortmund. Um, but one thing he does do better than Hakimi in is a pass completion rate. So I think the pass completion is very much in Mounier's favour and he can deliver that to Dortmund's back line. Uh, of course, Dortmund are going to really miss Hakimi. Uh, he'll be a big miss to the squad. Um, when he's set to go back to Real Madrid at the end of his two-year loan deal. I'm sure, you know, with Aldri Zola in the right-back position at Real Madrid already, I'm sure Hakimi will grow and grow and grow at Real Madrid, and I definitely think he'll be a good fit for their back line in the future. So I think when he comes back to Real Madrid, I think they may loan him out again, or they may keep him to become a backup uh, full-back for Real Madrid. But with Dortmund and PSG, 
I think Munier would be a good fit at Dortmund and I think PSG could lose a really good right back here. I think for Paris Saint-Germain in general, I think this is a real um, sort of rebuilding period. Because of course, with the four, you look at the four players out of contract. Kazawa, probably going to go to Juventus in my opinion. Mounier looks to be going to Dortmund. So that's two full backs, left and right, that are going. Um, and then you look at the two veteran players that are out of contract and looks like they won't be getting an extension. Cavani and Thiago Silva. That's a striker and a centre-back you're going to have to fill. Obviously, I'll do a separate video in the future uh, if you want me to, guys, in the comments down below. If you want me to do a video on like, what players do I think will replace Thiago Silva and Edison Cavani at PSG. Uh, so if you want to see that video, please comment down below. Uh, but for now, guys, I hope you love this transfer talk on Thomas Mooney and Borussia Dortmund. Obviously, this is just one series on the channel. Uh, I'm going to do plenty more series uh, while football is not being played at the minute. Uh, so things like player fact files, so for any new transfers or any people rumoured to be coming to the Premier League uh, or any of the big leagues, obviously we'll do some fact files on them to sort of discover the history, uh, some of the statistics from the previous season at their current club uh, and sort of deliver as to what they could offer. Um, we'll do some more transfer updates, we'll do some more normal football updates. Uh, we've got one coming in the future from Macclesfield Town and the stuff that's been going down there recently uh, and some other things as well. So we've got all that to look forward to on this channel. Thank you very much for watching. My name is Aaron Chandler. Goodbye.